my name's Latifa and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to do a Mother's Day special. I've got my daughter with me here today, Millie. You want to introduce her? You want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> my voice. <laughs> okay, so for today's Mother's Day special, I thought I'd invite Millie onto the show and she is going to do me a Mother's Day makeup. I mean, I doubt you'd put anyone else in the show. I'm like, I'm your only daughter, I forgot to say. <laughs> I'm excited because she's not done my makeup before on camera and I don't know what she's going to do. So, what are you going to do? Right, okay. So, I'm going to do kind of natural on the face, a yeah. natural lip. A kind of nudish lip. My nude, not your nude. Okay, fair. And pastels, like... Pastels. Pastels. I've never actually wore pastels before. But okay, let's give it a go. I've never done a pasta look on anyone, so this could go very wrong or very well. <laughs> okay, so do you want to get started? I'm gonna put I'm gonna put my hair back so you don't get it all up in my hair. I think it's too late for that, isn't it, Mum? Is it? Is it all in my hair? You already got foundation. Yeah, in your I hair did. Before. I had foundation on my hand before, and, and she did this with, with her hair. this, and now somewhere in here I've got colours. I mean, you already have colours in there anyway from when you painted you. Yeah, I've got body paint in here as well. I've got green, I've got all sorts going on. That was a lot. I know, it was a lot, wasn't it? <laughs> right, so I'm going to start by putting a bit of moisturiser on beforehand because my just, skin just, is just so <laughs> dry. Just a bit. Oh, Mum. I put bit. way too much moisturiser on my... <laughs> just the whole bottle of it. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to get you to talk me through the process as you're doing it. Me. I'm putting a, a glow primer on a face. Okay just to eliminate the skin and I'm excited prep and perfection her face there's that whole blob on just that one cheek <laughs> I keep forgetting how big your face is compared to mine oh I haven't got a big face I've just got a I have face. a planet head yeah but you've just got an 11 year old face and I've got a 30 year old face oh, I, I don't no. know why I keep saying 30 because I'm not even 30 yeah I'm still 29 I'm still 29 no no listen clinging on to 29 she, she's, to like, she's clinging on and we're like clips like <laughs> tiny little <laughs> ten putting up clips she's like not even with her hands anymore not even a nails clips <laughs> okay so i finished priming her face i now need to foundation your face so are you gonna go for a foundation now because I mean, it's you don't put your foundation on then, do you? No, I always do, I always do my eyes first. I can't do that because I, I, I go over the eyes, 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 then do the skin. No, but I yeah. go over the eyes with the foundation, so Ooh. it just ruined the makeup, really, wouldn't it? <laughs> right, you're gonna get be careful of that. I can't believe you've got still got pen on your hand. It wouldn't this. genuinely come off. Oh, for I was trying sake. for so long and it wouldn't come off. Okay, so we're just applying the foundation. Putting this one on her face in colour 303. Okay, you're beating my <laughs> face. I asked for a makeover, <laughs> not a black eye. <laughs> okay, concealer. One piece of advice I would give you in terms of this, because obviously you're not a trained makeup artist, but One I would piece. always do the concealer after the eyes, and only because any kind of fallout is going to sit straight into your concealer. I always, um, before I always do the eyes, I always bake. Okay, so it won't stick as much. Foundation from the hand to the skin. That is the same colour as your foundation. I know this is a thing because my skin is so pale at the moment that my found like my concealer is actually the same colour as my face. It's just ridiculous. As my foundation, so I need to go and pick up some cooler concealer. We have or cool I just concealer. need to go outside and get some sun on my skin because it's just a nightmare. Just gonna blend this in on this side to make it obviously. Match the opposite side of the face because <laughs> that's what we're all about in makeup. Okay, so it's looking good. So I've just blended it in on the nose. 
clearly. And yeah, so I'm now going to bake her face. We need, oh, and the concealers we used was, yeah, there we go. this one in the shade Toffee. Okay, then now I'm going to take, it's not got a number on this, but it's a Morphe brush, it's a big fluffy brush. This brush. okay, so we have a problem with this brush. Yes, we do. We washed this. We washed brush. this brush in a lick in like uh, mushroom liquid, and we put it with white brushes. We didn't know this was gonna happen. These are what the white brushes turn out like. Yeah, so I thought it'd be really nice and wash both of our brushes, all of our brushes together, and this demon brush. Actually ruined all of my brushes. I can't get this black dye out of any of my brushes now and the screwed so So we ha also have a problem with this. Oh, it's a hair on me. Take it off uh. me <laughs> Open it and It's already all there and it doesn't want to like the powder doesn't want to go back into the little holes I've done this many times my translucent powder just seems to go back through the holes without a problem Like sometimes I'm trying to get it out and it just goes back through the holes and I'm trying to get it out. This just doesn't want to leave. This is stay. This stays here. Do you know what I do as a tip? If you get pour nah, it. that, don't do that. Okay, right. So get some on your brush, like that. Bring it over to your lid. Tap it out. It gets it all over my leggings. Okay, so the way I do powder, I do it different to everyone else. I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I just do it like that, just like that, yeah? Okay. <laughs> and wipe it on the face. That feels like a lot of powder. It was a lot of powder. Okay. <coughs> Cost powder everywhere. Okay, let's go again. Hold <laughs> your breath, mom. basically like a whole jar of Morphe banana powder all over me. All of my black trousers, which is just great. Great, yeah, yeah, thanks. Thanks for that, mate. Yeah, that, <laughs> that is perfect. Next, we are doing eyebrows. Woo! I'm usually not very good at eyebrows, not gonna lie. Well, in my opinion, I'm good at them, but then other people are like, why are your eyebrows so big? <laughs> like, they're not. Right, in terms of eyebrows, you always overdraw your eyebrows. I love overdrawing my eyebrows. It's like my strange addiction is like drawing my eyebrows like, <laughs> up here. <laughs> Her eyebrows are usually like this. The, they're Just not. Always. Right, okay. I'm gonna do my mom's <laughs> eyebrows like I do my eyebrows. Oh God, here we go. Okay, okay so we're gonna use the Morphe M158. Start from about here. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna miss that whole chunk of the fluffy bit of the eyebrow, and I'm gonna start from when like here where my finger is, and I'm gonna underline it from there. Okay, so that just looks better and then it doesn't look dragged down, it looks more more curvy. See, I usually like bring mine out that way, but I know you like to kind of bring it in a little bit, but it's still cute. Still like it. You're doing a good job. Okay, so now I'm going to base the eye with this. So I'm going to use three palettes. I'm going to use my Jawbreaker palette. It's still in the box. <laughs> Um, my James Charles next Morphe one and my hit the lights one hit my face Okay, so now I'm gonna take the M224 brush and just like conceal over half of the purple, kind of, just to put the color over the top of what I'm gonna put on the eye. Cute. Then 
and I think they did a really really good job so far I'm really pleasantly surprised some nice range of colors there okay so now <laughs> we're gonna do the contour yeah contour okay so now I'm going to do highlight Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna take glowing. Turn back to me. Sorry. I got lost in the glow. Okay, so what have we done so far? We have got the eyes, highlight, show your lips now. Yep. Okay, let's do it. I'm going to line line your lips with this. Line it, yes, yeah, sure. This one on her lips. Shiner. Ooh, so a bit of mascara. You can let me put the mascara on. What do you want me to wear? I can, it's easier. I can just put it on, it's not a problem. You want me to do it? Yes. Okay. So what's your favourite part about the makeup? The blue bit on you. Yeah. The like the crease cut. I love it, I think it's really, really nice. I'm really pleased. And the eyebrows. You actually smashed my eyebrows. You might have even converted me into a bigger brow. So well done. Well done. Thank you so much for watching this video today. I am buzzing with this makeup and I'm really pleased to get Millie a little feature on here and just showing her skills at 11 years of age. Thank you for my Mother's Day makeover. It's okay. You've got mascara on your nose though. So if you like this video today, what should they do? They should like the video comment on the video, subscribe to this channel, then they should follow both of our Instagram, mine's makeup by MHXOX, I think. <laughs> My mum's Instagram is Indigo Moon Artists, her Facebook is Indigo Moon Artists. And TikTok, Bo yeah. TikTok, <laughs> hers is Indigo Moon Artists with an underscore at the end of it, no capitals are just the same. Mm -hmm. And then mine's just Miller with dot dot Hilton dot dot. Thank you so much, Millie. Thank you everyone for watching. And yeah, if you have any comments and any videos that you want us to do, just let us know in the comments below. Thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye now. Bye.